found e-careers over the internet. Um, when I was, I started looking at um, studying, uh, well, studying for AWS and getting to learn um, AWS. Um, and one of the things that popped up fairly quickly was e-careers and I think the job placement um, program. Um, and, I th one of, and I think after that, I saw uh, a, an event that you had where you could do a bit of a taste of evening to learn more about e-careers. And that's what I, and that's really how I came to know about e-careers. I think after that taste of event, that kind of gave me a bit more of an insight into what you do. I particularly enjoyed the AWS course. That was, that was great. I think the thing that stood out for me is, I didn't just want to pass the exam. That was not the point of me coming on the course. That's not why I wanted to do this. I wanted to actually learn how to architect in AWS. Um, and that's what this course gave me. It gave me, it helped. Passing the exam was just validating my knowledge. Passing the exam was just a, it, it just confirmed what I'd learned on the course. Um, I think the key takeaway for me was I, actually learned and I actually understood what I was doing. And I think to start from a place where I had zero IT experience to being able to confidently put together an AWS architecture and be able to justify it and understand why you should use one service over the other in a given instance. I think for me to do that in about nine, 10 months, it's just, it's mind blowing for me. So I think it's achieved what it needed to do. I had been working towards this my entire career. That's what I thought I wanted. And I'd been working through it. And it was awesome. I had a great team. I had, it was a great organization, but I just felt that I needed to pursue this cloud computing career. And I took one of the biggest, I took the biggest risk in my career, leaving my job and trying this out. Thanks a lot, I appreciate it.